let us have an assessment of what we have learned so far under respiratory system. This quiz is a short 10 question quiz. So write 1 to 10 on the margin of your notebook where you are going to write your answer. It is a multiple choice quiz. Therefore, you have option A to option D for each question. So you will write down your answer for each question in your notebook. We will then go through the answers later. Study the diagrams in this set of questions. Identify the parts that is highlighted and answer the question that follows. The first question says, name the part of the respiratory system. A. Adveoli. B. Mouth. C. Lungs. And D. Diaphragm. So write your answer in your number one. Question two. Name the part of the respiratory system. So look at the highlighted parts and pick your answer from this option. Option A, alveoli. B, bronchiolus. C, trachea. D, diaphragm. Write your answer in your note. Question three. Name the part of the respiratory system. So look at the highlighted part in the diagram. A. Bronchus. B. Bronchiolus. C. Trachea. And D. Capillary. Question 4. Name the part of the respiratory system. Look at the part highlighted and answer the question. A. Adveoli. B. Bronchiolus. D C. Diaphragm. And D. Bronchus. 5. Name the part of the respiratory system. Look at the highlighted parts inside the circle. A. Capillary. B. Bronchiolus. C. Alveoli and D, diaphragm. Question six. Name the parts of the respiratory system. A, alveoli. B, bronchiolus. C, diaphragm. And D, bronchus. Question seven. Name the parts of the respiratory system where gaseous exchange takes place. A. Alveoli B. Bronchiolus C. Diaphragm and D. Bronchus Question 8 Energy produced during respiration is stored in form of A. ADH B. ATP C. DNA and D. RONA Pick your answer. Question 9. The byproduct or waste product of respiration process is dash and dash. A. Oxygen and glucose. B. Glucose and water vapor. C. Carbon dioxide and oxygen. And D. Carbon dioxide and water vapor. Question 10 and the last question. The windpipe is also called what? A. Pharynx. B. Larynx. C. Trachea. And D. Lungs. Now I'll give you 15 seconds to go through your answers again before we review the real answer.
Are you ready for the answers? Let's look at the answers. The answer to number one is option B, the mouth. The part highlighted in the circle is the mouth. The answer to question two is option C, the trachea. So the part in the circle highlighted is the trachea or windpipe. The answer to question three is option A, the bronchus. The bronchus is the part that leads into the lungs. The answer to question four is option B, bronchiolus. The bronchi branch into smaller tubes called bronchiolus as highlighted in this diagram. The answer to question five is option C, alveoli. The bronchiolus leads to smaller tubes, millions of smaller tubes called alveoli, where the normal gaseous exchange takes place. And you can see this in this diagram. The answer to question C is option C, diaphragm. The diaphragm is highlighted here, lying just below the lungs. The answer to question 7 is option A, alveoli. Alveoli is the part where the actual gaseous exchange takes place during respiration. The answer to question 8 is option B, ATP, that is adenosine triphosphate. This is the form in which energy produced are being stirred. The answer to question 9 is option D, carbon dioxide and water vapor. The byproduct or waste product of respiration is carbon dioxide and water vapor. Finally, the answer to question 10 is option C, trachea. The trachea is also called the windpipe. That will be all for this lesson and for this question and answer period. I hope you have corrected the wrong options that you have chosen in your answer and you have learned something great in this lesson. Remember, don't stop reading. If you need to go back to the videos again, please feel free to click the links and watch the video over and over again so that you get acquainted with the concepts. Till we meet again, either in class or online. God bless you for watching this video. Bye.